Hi guys, it's me Mia. I haven't done a video in a while, like an orthodontic video in a while. Oh, excuse me. And I actually wanted to post this before I have my baby. Um, I am almost 39 weeks pregnant. And yes, I am still working. I'm working full time. There we go. I am still currently working. Um, I'm almost 39 weeks pregnant. I literally have like less than 11 days <laughs> until I am due with my second baby. And I just wanted to share with you guys that I just hit my one year mark at my orthodontic office, which I am so excited one year 365 hey 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 so yes I just hit my one year um, mark at my orthodontic office and I'm so excited and um, before I get started and like talk about like what this year has been like and what I learned and all that good stuff do you want to put a disclaimer out there I started putting it on all of my videos um, basically saying that the views and opinions that are expressed in my videos are my own, not my um, doctor or my office or company or co-workers like opinions. They're all my own. Um, and yeah, so let's get started. Let's talk about what this year has been like. If you've been following me for a while, you know I went from being a Oh, excuse me. I got acid reflux and heartburn and burping and all of that stuff. Pregnant life. But anyways, as you know, I was a stay-at-home mom and I went back to work last year um, on my son's birthday, which is February 5th. And um, if you watch some of my old vlogs of me starting this journey, you know, it was... A challenge at first because I had been out of work for a while and it was just something new um, new doctor new patients new co-workers and I just I didn't know how I was going to do like I was confident in my skill but I didn't know how it was gonna work out and I must say this has been this has been the best year um, of my life working out of all of my years of doing this this has been like the greatest I still love my doctor still love my co-workers I still love my office um, it's gone really really good I've learned so much like I thought I knew a lot but I'm learning something new every single day like I've seen some cool stuff that I've haven't seen before I'm um, you know my skill is getting better and better and better the more you do it the better you get you know the better you do the patients are amazing and it's just going really really good um, let's see let's let's reflect back on this year like when I first started I like I said I was so nervous I was so like trying to be perfect um, that I just couldn't relax <laughs> like I had a hard time relaxing and now like because of who my doctor is like he's so calm he's so chill he's so patient um, it makes it easier for me to work if that makes sense like it's not stressful <laughs> So my tips that I would give someone who uh, is a assistant, orthodontic assistant, dental assistant, um, because I've seen some videos on here. There's um, a video that I watched of someone who basically was like that they hated dental assisting and that they wanted to switch careers and all the drama and all that stuff like that. And I'm like... I don't have that at my office like I come in I do what I have to do 
do my job and leave and go home and if you have like a personal issue leave it at the door don't bring it to work like i've learned that in all of my years like don't bring your personal issues to work because it's nobody's problem but your own right and always be kind to the patients even if they aren't the nicest be kind because essentially they are paying <laughs> paying you for a service they are giving you your paycheck you know what i mean um another tip is um q-tip and i learned this very like early on and it basically stands for quit taking it personal q-tip and it just means like if somebody has an attitude or a problem don't take it personal just brush it off do what you gotta do and leave it at that um also um i still I, and i'm still a big believer in um it's my motto don't be friends with um your co co-workers on social media i still don't have people following me i still don't follow people on social media um just because it can cause issues and problems and your personal life should be your personal life um your work life should be your work life so who you are at work um should be different from who you are at home you like you know what i mean like you, you need to separate the two i have a whole video about that you can watch that um and yeah just i'm just thankful i'm thankful for my one year here um i don't know i'm excited like <laughs> i don't know what else to say i'm just so excited i'm excited that i made it that um that they love me i had my review my review went well and yeah like <laughs> i don't know what else to say but if you have any suggestions or um questions or anything like that just ask them in the comments down below and i will try to get to them i'm gonna try to film like some more like q a some more tips and tricks um when i'm on maternity leave which should be coming up pretty soon um just leave them in the comments i know some of the questions that i get is kind of um like you can kind of basically google it like somebody asked me like where could I get a, a, a top it on from and I'm like just google it like <laughs> I don't know <laughs> I've been out of school for a while so I'm not sure where you can get a good one from um but any questions or concerns or anything that you guys have let me know I'll be happy to answer them but thank you guys for following me during this journey I'm out of breath <laughs> um, and uh, yeah I will see you guys soon so one year I made it I made it I made it thanks for watching bye guys